Yo kama Kenya kama dawa kama kawaida siku nyingine tena tunakuletea mambo kama kawaida kama gisi tuwe kwa idi kwa mbeti kila siku na kila wiki tutakuwa tunakuletea update ambazo naendelea mita ya kati hapa kwetu Australia na Brisbane zima kwa hiyo uh, kaa hapo hapo ili ujua nini ambacho kinaendelea ukiangalia upande wangu wa kuume hapa naye mrembo fulani hivi ambayo yuko na uh, urembo wake ambao uko natural wewe mwingine hivi jamani kikuangalia sana <laughs> ni noma sana kwa hiyo kaa hapo hapo hivyo ili uende kusikiliza nini ambacho kinaendelea hapa na tuende kuupdatea kila kitu ambacho kinaendelea kwenye mitaa ya kati kwa hiyo mrembo mambo vipi good 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 you fresh i am okay nice to be here today uh, so how are you by the way fine thank you you fine yeah thank you welcome thank you okay so um Before kwanza twende sijui pande zote hivi kwanza tunataka tufahamu wewe bana wewe una look fresh sana sijui nani tukienda kwa Instagram yako tukiangalia picha zako na nini una picha zingine ambazo ni kali kali sana hivi tukiangalia hivi zinakuwa you know <laughs> ya vizu kama na hivyo hivi tukiangalia ukitaka kushop kitu sijui nguo kiatu hivi bei gani ya mwisho ambayo ikipitiza sana uweze ukashop hicho kitu maybe like in fun let's say uh, shoes maybe <laughs> probably from 400 400 yeah 4 to 3 if it's like over that. then 400 wewe uka uka nani to kitu i can but okay. you know it's it depends okay. if i like the brand then i would definitely probably go for it okay that's yeah. good so um uh first of all uh, tukiangalia vizuri siku za hapo nyuma kidogo tumekuona ulikuwa ukiapia sana kwenye mambo ya sijui ya ulikuwa ukitokelezea uki, uki kwanza kwenye ma, mambo ya maclip fulani fulani hivi sijui kama zile sijui kama sometimes kwa kama comedy so Fresh. vitu kama na hivyo so baada tena baada ya muda mwingine kidogo tukakuona tena umetokelezea kwa move fulani hivi ambayo ulitoka kwa zina la problems ulikuwa mondani mule um afu umeact vizuri sana kwanza ongera sana congratulations you did well and vitu vilikuwa vizuri sana so nataka kujua hivi ile confidence How come sabu the way you act ulikuwa kama vile umeanza kitambo sana long time so how was it Okay so first of all um during high school masomo nilifanya ka drama Okay for about two years so I think that's why gave me the confidence mm-hmm. to be in front of the camera Yep but also it takes courage for somebody to be on front of the camera because it's not everyone that has confidence you know yep. I mean, you can still have the confidence but how's kwa ni talent akufanya kitu so for me it's like ile drama ndio nilisaidia sana also kwenda kunyumba ku take practice and all that kind of stuff okay yeah vizuri sana so uh, the first uh, when they call you and tell you that uh, we have a movie so we need you to be a part of it how did you feel Oh my god actually the first time i was really terrified i was really scared yep so ngwa sema oh my god me see si kwa mbele ya camera you know yep. na bato bako naangalia because it's not only one person who's involved there's other people at the back the cameraman mm. the uh, you know mtu mwenye anakamata anakamata sound yep. bato watakwambia you know na bidi unafanya hivi unafanya hivi so i was really scared but then um i was encouraged you know yep. so You know I had to just do what I got to do and then yeah Oh okay that's good so uh, we always see you on um, just on movie in, movies in the industry and then uh, we know that we have our artists here in Brisbane so what do you feel uh, how come so you can appear even in the music industry do you think like is that difficult because you can't dance or something like that Um actually <laughs> I have appeared in I think one or two mm-hmm. music videos So yeah Can you remember the video? Yeah, okay. um ni nyimbo mwana itwa You're so sweet. You're so sweet. Yeah, na ingine Oh, the one from Yubi Master? Yeah, that one. Okay, yo, oh, yeah. <laughs> I remember. <laughs> <laughs> na ah uh, vizuri sana. Kwa hiyo ah yeah, 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 yeah. na ikumbuka vizuri sana ile nani mfanya ya Yubi Master. So mmefanya vizuri sana pale by the way. So ah uh, baada pale si ikakuwa umepoa so au kuendelea sana nafikiri kwamba eti nini ambacho kitumia ladha michongo au au kupata ile michongo au vipi watu hawaku contact vitu kama hivyo au vipi oh sio kama eti watu hawaku contact or anything like that so najua like kama uko mwanafunzi and you have other things that you're dealing with it's yep. really hard kufani less space like muda kuko interact with so many different things because at the same time you know I'm shooting a film being in a music video mm. and I'm also a student so at the same time I have to make sure that I squeeze time masomo mm. mbele yep. before anything else yep. that's why 
you have people haven't seen me a lot in other music videos and all you know that kind of stuff but Something okay. is coming. Okay, vizuri sana. So everything in a day in a time management, unaweza ka save time, ukafanya hiki, unafanya hiso, we mweni unondo, unaweza kwa ni manage. So, vipi ya kija mtu sasa hivi kwa mbeti, sijui ana nani music ya mbao anahitaji mtu kama vile modo, wadja ingie vipi. Unazani kwa mbeti yu inaweza kuwa easy kwa kuza sasa hivi kuifanya na process gani, unaweza mga piti hadi mga fanya yu kitu? Um, I would probably have to think about it mm -hmm. before like, ni tike ni seme yes, inabidi ni kuwa kwa sabu, when you said yes to somebody, mm. they will depend on you. Na bata, you know, but okay, nisha kwa na mtu mwenye tafanya hivi na hivi. So it's good when you think about it and you let them know mm. if you're going to do it just in case if you have so many other things that are coming your way. Yep. So I think the best option is to think about it, you know. Okay. Yeah. Oh, vizuri sana. So, uh, VP, uh, filamu sasa hivi ndo habari ya mjini hapa ambayo ni kazi ambayo unifanya vizuri sana na unaifanya vizuri sana hivi plan yuko vipi unafikiri kwamba ile kitu utaendelea kuifanya au vipi um okay first of all i as much as i enjoy acting as yep. i said uh, maybe in the future yes i would love to do it even though i've got my other stuff that i'm doing yep. so let's just said let's wait and see what the future has for me. That's good. I yeah. like that. So, um, so Saivi, uh, okay, okay, no, you do acting movie and you act well. So, okay, acting movie and kuna watu wengi sana mbao wanangalia ili movie. Uh, so, vipi uja kutanaga nazo zile sijui, uh, sijui mashori, kufatilia, sijui nini, nimekuona kwa movie, mipena hiyo, kama kutaku kuingilia ingilia hivi inside, kama kutafuta some relationships, vizu kama na hivi, unafiki kwa mbeti, ayu kulete yagi siida kwa imaisha yako ya real. Um, not really, but sometimes you do have people that would um, probably approach you in a negativity way, but then yeah. it's the reality, you know, you're not always going to expect people to like, approach you, like, like something that is nice or anything like that. Mm -hmm. But to be honest with you, when um, my first one, actually, my, the person that I'm talking to, he wasn't as happy, but then Anailewa. Later on, Alikelewa Kasima, oh, that's fine if you know it's something that you love doing, and he was like, I can actually support you. So, yeah. Yeah, um, to me, Angelia Kusu, uh, Vitu Abavunapania, to me, Angelia Kusu, Nani, Mziki, Nani, Nikwayo, um, Labda, Sunadua, uh, Wanasima Skuzote, Kwameti, Akunam Sani, Akuna Stabila Media, Kwayo Media, Society, what one to Fatiliano, and Juanin, and Batu and Delia Vitu Kamanaibo, Kwayo, um, VP, um, Labda kuna mtu atahitaji kukufata zaidi sana na dili yake mchongo nini movie sijui mambo ya music everything kwa hiyo anakupata vipi kwa Instagram vitu kama na hiyo au social media Facebook uh, nini ambacho unatumia sana sana na anakupata vipi uko sijui kwa majina zaidi sana Um so mimi na kuona Snapchat na niko yeah. na Instagram yeah. I do have Facebook but I don't use no, it most of the time much. but if you were to look for me on Snapchat or Instagram yeah. just search up at Nella Amani you be able to find me on the social media. Safi sana kama vile actor kama vile nani mambo yako unahitaji mtu pembeni pale ambao atakungalisha kitu chako kama kitu unavyomwona mwana amenaa hapo mwenye mtoto wake bana akiingia kwenye kitu chako hapo jamani kinajiuza ndugu yangu kwa hiyo utapata kwa majina ambayo amekuambia sasa hivi pata kwenye Instagram Nel Amani kutana naye hapo mpango mwingine mtapanga panga sitaki kujua mnapata na vipi sijui mtonyo nini na nini kwa hiyo mtajua na huko huko au sio kwa hiyo vitu kama na hivyo ah Nela la kizushi kidogo hivi wewe um kuna shemeji <laughs> Mara nyingi sana tukiingia kwa Instagram yako atuoni atuoni sana sana so unajua tunaona zile sijui mambo ya snap na disnap mwenye so atujaona ka shemeji mule ndani vipi kama yuko vipi kwa nini una, unaamua kwenda hivi chini chini sana sana <laughs> Okay um so first of all tunaona me I'm the type of person mimi na kwaka mtu um, like niko mfichi sana when it comes to my relationship issue Unafanya I don't like private <laughs> Yeah I'm a very private person Why private Because I've realized that in the past, mm -hmm. when you post someone that you're dating, mm -hmm. everybody gets involved into your relationship. Yep. So as I grew, I came to realize that if I have a partner or I'm seeing somebody, I don't have to expose it on social media. Although there is somebody that I'm talking to, but I'm just keeping it low key. Okay. When the right time comes, then everybody will be able to see him. Okay, that's good. Cool. <laughs> so uh, another one. Um, which kind of men that you can date or that you won't date and why and why not? Um, <laughs> oh my God. Just go. <laughs> go ahead. 
Okay, first of all, how can I you know, there's not a bad man or there there's not a good man. Yep. At the end of the day, all men are the same. Yep. But you as a woman, you can change. And as a man, you can also still change a woman. Yep. Um, for me, I would date a guy who's um any guy who's independent, mm-hmm. he is mature enough to look after you himself mm-hmm. and also you. Mm-hmm. And a man who's um who hustles. Mm. He has to go out there and hustle for himself. Yep. And um, also a man with a decent character. Yep. And, you know, that's, that's basically it. So, <laughs> the kind of men that I wouldn't date will probably... Mm-hmm. Um, Just keep it on. I don't know if I should say that. <laughs> Just go um, ahead. Just go ahead. People, they really want to know from you. So, <laughs> just make it clear. The kind of men that I wouldn't date, mm. probably the men have to be lazy. Then I wouldn't want to date a man who is lazy. Because, you know, mm. if you're going to be lazy, then how are you going to be mm. capable of taking care of me and starting a family and, you know, being there for me if I need anything, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? Okay. So, basically, if you're hardworking and, you know, you're, mm. you're, you're mature, what kind of responsibility I could take care of them, why not? Wow. <laughs> okay, that's good. So they say boys in Brisbane are players. Hiyo kitu wagu unaichukulia vipi? Sababu watu wengi kwanza wanaongea hizo tunakutana nazo mtaani. So ukiwa na ukiwa kama wewe hizo deal unazichukuliaga vipi? Na huko mtu mmoja wale watu ambao wanasemaga hivyo au vipi? Sababu so unajua now and days things are changing. So kuna watu wanasema eti watu boys in Brisbane are players. Sijui vitu kama na hivyo. While boys now wanaona kwamba eti girls in Brisbane are players too. So hiyo kitu ukiwa kama wewe una 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 vipi kitu? Um, first of all, okay, about that, mm. I have nothing to say because I have actually never dated anyone from Brisbane, you know. Mm-hmm. So when people say that, oh, maybe Brisbane boys are players and all that kind of stuff, like it's not Brisbane boys, men are men, you know, at the end of the day. I mean, you can mm. still go maybe to Sydney, Melbourne, mm. Tasmania, Adelaide, and you still like find guys that are players. Yep. It's just a matter of you finding the right person at the right time. But um, the ones that I know, mm-hmm. the ones that I know, maybe that I've dated my friends in the past, I know they are players from what they've been through. <laughs> but <laughs> but um, okay. I mean, I can I can still say maybe I can never date anyone from Brisbane, but then at the end of the day, I can still find a man who's decent and has a decent character, and I can still date them. But mm-hmm. Brisbane boys, um, I wouldn't really say anything because I have never come across anyone that actually attract me and be like, oh, this is the person that I really want to date. But then although there are some that lives here that would maybe want to start something off with me, but then it's just me that I haven't, I think I haven't found the right person. So I wouldn't really say like their plays and all that kind of stuff. I'm not. I'm not too sure, but <laughs> <laughs> I got yeah. you. <laughs> That's good. So you say that you never date um, Brisbane boys. You never um, date Brisbane boys. You never 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 date Okay, so let's just say, okay, first of all, let mm-hmm. me just say that I've been here since, I've been in Brisbane since 2007, so I've been here for a while. Oh, you've been in there. Yeah, oh, I've been here God. for a while. For a while. So, yeah, I um, I mean, th- there was somebody that I had maybe a crush on in the past, but then that was when I was still a child. I didn't really know what love is or relationship. You know, when you just meet somebody. Yep. But now I wouldn't say that it's love. I would say maybe I was just attracted to his beauty. Yep. But... I wouldn't say that it was love, love, like I wanted to date him, like my boyfriend and all that kind of stuff, you know? Yep. But I guess it's just that it's just me. I haven't found the right person here in Brisbane that I would say I'm attracted to. Because, um, yeah, like the majority of them, I've, mm. I've seen them, like I know what they're into. So it's kind of like, ooh, yeah. you know, I know, I mean, you know, as I said before, I know the kind of men that I'm looking for. Mm-hmm. So it's kind of, it, it's, it's quite complicated when... You know, you know somebody, you know what they're into, and then you're like, mm, I wouldn't want to date this person because, you know, we got different personalities. Like, we're two different people. Mm-hmm. That's um, the one reason why I would say I've never really dated anyone from Brisbane. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's good. So, uh, do you like parties or clubbing, things like that? Oh, my God. Um, 
I'm very Indo person, you know, the type of person that people see on social media, like going crazy and all that kind of, I'm not that kind of person. Mm -hmm. I'm really an Indo person. Um, I like, let me say, I like going to weddings. Yep. Maybe birthday parties, something like that, but anything that is crazy, clubbing, yep. it's not my kind of lifestyle. Although I'm not against anyone that goes to clubbing or any or that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. It's just me and my personality really. Maybe once in a while, but nah, it's not <laughs> really my thing. <laughs> okay. Yeah. That's good. So um Maranyi sana uh kuna marafiki ambayo una rafikiana na usasaivi. So some of them they like party things, bitu kama na ivo, bitu kama na ivo. So you never know. So do you think like what you got nearby on a weza uka kuwa on a share now like friendship with kama na ivo? What 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 I think you got nearby on a karafikiana now and by weza karafikiana now like kuwa close to close. Um, the type of friend that I would say I would really want to like be close with and build a strong relationship. Yep. Is the type of friend that would advise me doing the right thing and pushing me forward mm -hmm. to um, a better future. Yep. And know uh, a friend that would all the time be like, oh, you know, babes, you know, we, know, we, we need to go parties, you know, something is happening at the clubs, we need to go like, that type, um, those type of friends, I wouldn't say that um, they they want to see you do good in the future. You know, Rafiki Muzuri Ule Munyata to encourage and you know, do this, like if you do this, utafanyikiwa, ungi soma ivi, you're gonna have a perfect life if you take care of yourself. You're gonna do better. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. But not them type of crazy. I mean, you can still have them type of crazy friend, but then you as a person, yep. When I do Nangaleon and Sema, like, okay, just because they're doing this, I don't have to do it. Mm. But then at the end of the day, there is a chance that Unizuka Kwa maybe influence a little bit. Yep. So those type of friends, I try to like avoid them and be like, you know, get away from them. <laughs> yeah, I get away. Like, yep. we'll still be friends, but then I wouldn't like you know, follow the footsteps yep. because I wouldn't want to enter into something that you know. <laughs> Red. Yeah. So, um, I'm going to talk about the nani, the problems that I'm going to talk about in the So, society, to expect in Nguine, Lini, any plan? I am not sure, but ho hopefully something will be cooking out soon. Okay. Yeah, so hopefully, but I'm not sure when. You're not sure? Yeah. Why are you not sure? Because <laughs> um, we've got one mm -hmm. that is coming out soon. Okay. And um, it's not quite... Tell them, tell them, tell them. <laughs> yeah, it's not quite finished. Mm -hmm. So maybe when it's finished, then maybe something else is going to come. Because mm -hmm. it's probably going to come out in November or December. So okay. I still have a long way to be talking about, oh, maybe there's another one that's coming out. Because we have to finish this one first. Okay. Yeah, before... Anything else comes up. <laughs> That's good, which means yeah. things are still on on the kitchen. Yeah, it's still yeah. on the kitchen. It's cooking, it's boiling. It's <laughs> <laughs> I know. It's going to change. Oh, it's going to change. I'm going to be happy. I'm going to be I'm going to be happy. I'm going to be happy. I'm going to be happy. I'm going to be I'm going to be happy. I'm going to um, let me think. Maybe. Are you want to lie to me? <laughs> Just to be honest. Actually, you do you there's a, in Brisbane. I don't think there's any like musician that I'm into. Maybe the outside is out of, out of the country, yeah, but in Brisbane, mm. maybe, I don't know, maybe I would say, maybe Baby J, but mm. I don't really think there's any, <laughs> any musician in Brisbane, really. <laughs> Yani Kabisa or Mangale Kabisa or Nana Kwambeti, Yani Kusema, Yani to make it short, like you are quite some interest in Kwangalia, Mamboya, Pavitu Kamanaibo, or VP. Um. I mean, to be honest with you, really, nothing mm. really entertains me in Brisbane. I mean, okay. it depends what it is, but then, you know, entertainment is something you just come out when I feel like, yep. you know, like when I feel like I'm entertained. I'm entertained. Yep. But for me, there's really nothing that really, in, like, some stuff do, but not really, you know, it's 
Nothing really entertains me. <laughs> okay. Yeah. That's good. It's a good better boss out of the beginning. So I like the way you say that. Uh, kuna mambo mengine ambayo una hitaji kwanza we feel unajua kila kitu yeah. una ki feel kwanza and then mm. una get deep deep. Yeah. Wewe si kupe shida sana. Yeah. Um vipi tukikwangalia vizuri wewe ni mtu ambaye wewe unaweza ukafanya mambo ya modeling vitu kama na hivyo vipi ushawahi kufikiria fikiria hicho kitu labda kufanya like modeling things you know. Yeah, actually in 2000 and um 2015 I think I yeah I did I did a modeling for um for some guy that owns like an okana shona mangweno that kind of stuff so oh, okay. yeah. yeah I did model for him but then also for the past few years I did apply to okay. a model and I did make into modeling but unfortunately mm-hmm. um my conditions zenye zenye really feel like a bit comfortable you know revealing mm-hmm. my body and all that kind of stuff I mean yeah. it's not bad but as for me I was like I you know I didn't have the confidence to like yeah. do it so I had to drop it oh. yeah Okay vizuri sana. Ah uh, hiyo ni fresh sana. Kwa hiyo ah um, sasa hivi time yetu ni kama vile zinaenda yenda kwa hiyo fanya kama una bless watu kama unawaambia kitu maana tunaona time zetu zinaenda yenda sasa hivi kwa hiyo fanya kama vile una bless kama unawaambia nini kitu kama ushauri vitu kama hiyo kwa hiyo watapikie. <laughs> okay so um what I would just like to say that um if you have a talent if you have a passion in anything go ahead and do it. Don't worry about what people going to say or think all the negativity at the end of the day if you have family friends that support you and you have a dream fight for it no matter what because at the end of the day you will still you might get somewhere in life and those ones that never supported you so na kwa you live at the wow you know that was shocked so that's what i have to say so <laughs> Vizuri sana nafikiri kwamba tu umepata vizuri sana hapo hivi ushauri wako wa mwisho na neno lake la mwisho umeenda kulipata vizuri sana kwa hiyo market kwa hiyo kama una talent fulani na nini unajua watu wanaongea vingi sana hapo ukiangalia vizuri ukizingatia vizuri watu ambao wanaponda vitu ni wale watu ambao huwezi kufanya kile kitu au walikuwaga nani afu wakatoka afu wanabaki kuwa wanaponda kile kitu yeah. make hiyo kwa kichwa yako afu kitu kingine ni kwamba um, fanya kama vile una bless hapo hivi ukiklik bata nyenye nyekundu ili ukuwe unapata updates zote tumekwambia kwamba eti kila wiki tutakuwa tunakushushia updates zinaendelea hapa kwa hiyo studio zetu za zitrufu siku ya leo tukua na hayo na mengi ambayo yatakuja kuendelea mtapata baadaye kwa hiyo kama kuna comment kitu chochote ambacho kinaendelea we drop share up down kidogo afu next step tukipita kwa interview ya pili tutapita na hiyo comment yako na kulizungumzia vitu kama navyo kama kawaida ulikuwa nami sugar boy kwenye mic niko naye ornella behind the camera alikuwa pale eshima video tuko pamoja sana na Mungu akubariki inshallah